All right, y'all. Part five. We ready? <laughs> this is part five of See What Had Happened Was. Let me get some chapstick, y'all. My lips are screaming. So this is part five of See What Had Happened Was. Um, if Dooney had shipped all my items together, you know, we could have just done this all in one video. But since they like to separate stuff, we just got to do them all together. And this box is way thicker than it needs to be for one little SLG. But that is what is in here. I did order this when I ordered the um, zip zip bag. So the intention was I wanted to get one of these pieces and I wanted to try it out. Um, and I wanted to use it with this bag, even though it's not a perfect match. It's still gorgeous. It's still Dooney and Burke. So, of course, you can mix, mix and match anything the way you want. But anyway... Let me wake up, y'all. I'm so tired. Oh, my goodness. My bestie was in town, um, unfortunately, because her husband lost his cousin unexpectedly. Um, he is from Columbus, Georgia, which is not too far from here. So, of course, they were out there. But, of course, on the way back, um, she stopped by, you know, for a couple hours so she could see me. But, of course, it was at old dark 30. So, I was up to, like, 1.30 in the morning just catching up, chit-chat, and having a good time. Ooh, this feels nice. Um, so me sleepy, me sleepy, me sleepy, stayed up a long time, way past my bedtime and then had to go to work, but it was great to see her. So this is the, we call it kiss lock and these purse streets. Um, this is the, uh, large frame purse. According to Dooney, this is the Navy color Greta print. Again, I have purchased it because I was going to use it inside of this baby, the Zip Zip Satchel, um, as kind of like my catch-all for some of my smaller things, as well as since it does have the card pockets in it, the plan is to put, or was to put, wait a minute, why does this look like this? The plan was to put my extra cards in here, like the ones I don't use every day. Um, I wasn't going to take all this stuff out, but now we absolutely, okay, so maybe we not successfully, but y'all, why these credit card slots in here look janky? Like the leather is like, I can't even grab this damn paper. Good Lord, how tight is it? Come on now. Anyway, why the leather look like this though? I was going to put extra credit cards in there. Y'all see that? What the hell is going on over here? This is some Louis Vuitton quality control bullshit here. What the fuck is this? That is not sexy. I mean, I guess if you put your cards in here rough enough, you could cause it to like fold back, but I don't know. Y'all know this, this piece is new to me and buying Dooney is new to me. So that's not normal. That's, that's not even, mm -mm. that is not attractive, but this is gorgeous. I wanted to feel what the Greta felt like. Um, I wanted to see what the Navy looked like in person. So I'm super excited that I did go ahead and pick this up. Um, but she's going back. I had thought about sending her back um, once I realized the zip zip satchel wasn't staying. She does not look cute with the DB75, which has her own kiss lock that I did purchase. Of course, she does not look sexy with the hydrangea, which I was not able to get the kiss lock since it was QVC only last year when the hydrangeas was first released. Um, and the bags were a little bit different, like the drawstring was a little bit bigger. There was no zipper on the front. Can y'all tell I did my research? But anyway, um, I was considering picking up a bag in Greta. I just wasn't sure which one um, and wasn't sure if I wanted to pick it up right now. But I did want to go ahead and get a piece so I'd have something from the collection to kind of go ahead and scratch that itch. And like I said, I had planned to use it inside the Zip Zip. So since the Zip Zip, and I'm going to give y'all the update, she is going back. Since she's going back, before I even open this box, I was like, mm, probably going to be sending this back too. I can always pick it up later. Um if and when I do pick up a Greta piece and I'm, you know, being OCD and want my SOGs to match. But she's super, super cute minus this damaged looking pocket on the inside. So even if I was going to keep her, I would have definitely exchanged her for a better looking one. I don't know if it's safe to say this is used or if this is just quality control. I don't know, but that's not sexy. So um, she is going back. I'm super happy with the pieces that I am keeping. Um, and that I do love. Unfortunately, I did pack all of my things. Can this? No, that might go to second level. I'm trying to pack this back the way they had it. I did put all of my things in the zip zip um, satchel, and she is a no go. I my things are just way too much. She was super pregnant, and it was one hard to zip her a little bit. I don't know how they got all this in here, y'all. That's a lot. Good night. Well, I got it back in there. 
um she was super pregnant but it also made the zipper very wonky so like on the side it was not smooth how it looks like fresh out the package like this which honestly to me i don't know this one looks a little wonky by itself like even with the bag empty this one looked a little wonky so of course when i stuffed my stuff in it that just got even worse um i could always just leave her unzipped and then not close her and still carry her but essentially this is what i gotta start paying attention to because i'm a tote girl and the totes usually have big ass butts like six inches to seven inches sometimes depending on who makes it um i have to start paying attention to this so when i'm gonna buy a bag if the butt is not I'm keep with y'all 100 with y'all the butt ain't six inches layla can't do it like that's what i figured out i wrote down a bunch of bags i thought was cute um from different brands a lot from duty and it's really the butt that's the issue for me if i can't lay out my things in a manner at the bottom then of course they have to start stacking towards the top and then that's where you run into the issue where you can't close it so although this is a very classy lady like bag it could easily be used on a time where i don't need to carry everything in the kitchen sink but i feel like i already have enough of those in my collection from you know coach louis all of that so i don't want to add to it so i may or may not pick her up in the future in a fun color just for like brunch <laughs> where i'm not gonna take all my stuff but i am gonna go ahead and send her back especially since you know i was expecting white and she is clearly not white she is bone this baby here Oh, chow. So she gonna need her own video. I am currently in her. If you follow me on Instagram, I did post a cute picture of her. Um, Sky Nine isn't in here. She's on the headboard where I keep her at night. So bust in my house in the middle of the night, you want to? Mm -hmm. Yeah, that part. Anyway, um, so she not in here right now. However, she does fit comfortably. This bag is bay. I should have known when Shonda said this bag was bay. It's hard to move out of her. She meant business. Dazzle Me 77, Miss Shonda was like, girl, when you put your stuff in that Brenna, listen here. And then Michelle from Determined Toby was like, fam, listen, you gonna love it. So they never lied. She's sexy. I did take that middle strap out. It does have the three parts um, so that you can wear a crossbody. Personally, in my opinion, if you're gonna wear a bag with this big ass butt, crossbody hell on your shoulder this is not the right strap this should have definitely been wider um but that's okay because i it's not like i wear mine when i want a satchel i want a satchel and i am on a break from carrying my totes i'm just kind of in the mood i want to be sassy and girly and flirty and so i am feeling the colors and the flowers and all that fun stuff so i have been carrying her by the handles since yesterday when i moved into her um i have put her on the crook of my arm and then just now to come upstairs because i had my box and some other stuff in my hands i did put the strap on my shoulder for the first time so i do think like i said that it's too thin it definitely should have been thicker for a bag this size with such a big mouth a big butt all these extra pockets but listen y'all this organization that the bag has with these extra spots is everything so she will get her own video where i will do what's in my bag and show you guys what's in there but i did want to show you guys the unboxing of this baby and then kind of give y'all an update because i know i be want updates folks have commented and asked for updates and y'all know i'm here to deliver so this baby here if you remember i have picked her up uh oh knock the bags over i have picked her up with this cutie so i had got the blue one as well as the cream one they were both cute as hell i could not choose and why should i have to especially when it was a mother's day sale and they were only 109 each so let me try to get them both in frame um so i still have my jewelry on here as you can see the brenna was super naked she don't even have a charm on her i told michelle last night she was like what color did you put on there i said girl i ain't even pick one yet she said what girl you sick you, we need to check your temperature. You ain't got no bag charm on the bag. <laughs> but I did move into her in the middle of the day. So I do need to visit my bag uh, cabinets and find some jewelry for her. But anyway, um, so I did move out of here and move into this. I absolutely love this blue one. I will admit the butt is not as big as the Brenner or as my tote bags or any other bags. Um, but I do absolutely love this blue in this style of bag. It's gorgeous. Everything fits. Um, it's just a matter of that whole Tetris game, and I really don't like having to do that. So this is definitely a gorgeous bag. She is staying in my collection. I absolutely love this blue. I don't mind paying, playing Tetris for a couple of days. Um, she could definitely be an everyday carry for a couple of days um, with no problem, but definitely decided that I'm not gonna keep both in that size since I don't love the Tetris game. So the cream one is going back. As you can see, she doesn't have her strap. She even still has her stuffing and everything is still inside of it, never unwrapped it. She is 
is going back, but not because I don't love the print. I love the print. It's just the bag and the butt that I need. I need a nice big six inch butt and I need some more space left to right to fit all my stuff. Cause my pregnant planner, she need room to breathe, honey. And she can't be doing a Tetris thing all super tight long term because you know, it'll mess up that VDS leather. So I'm going to send this back, but I'm gonna keep this print. So what I did was <laughs> I ordered the print like this the cream hydrangea print but in the Brenna style bag so essentially I'm exchanging it um, I'm gonna be getting another Brenna and I'm super excited but it's gonna be in this colorway with the hydrangea so super cute can't wait to see her especially since it's gonna be like you know a larger bag and a lot more of the material and the flowers and stuff showing and everything will still match you know the SOGs that I had you know the actual wallet and the um, coin purse I do have the um, medium wristlet that looks like this with the blue on it inside of the Brenna here I did not switch my catch-all because I just kind of like I said I moved into her in the middle of the day so I do have the medium wristlet in there but I don't intend to leave it in there I do have a cute pouch coming uh, Miss Michelle from the Deter determined to be um, showed me hers and told me where she got it and I'm like oh my goodness I need it so <laughs> I had my mom check the store near her and she did grab it so I just need to pick that up from her but I'm super excited to see these cuties go inside of the Brenna bag and the cream um, hydrangeas and like I said I do enjoy the blue one I will be using her she can be used as an everyday bag just not for like a whole week or longer because the whole Tetris game you know after like two days I'm over it but she's super cute I love that I picked her up I do not regret it at all this absolutely screams spring summer birthday in June all that fun stuff and of course the thick strap like you can't go wrong with this bag getting a thick strap because you can always use this on other bags if you choose to like for example when the Brenna comes instead of putting the thin strap on there I could always use this strap and just hook it right onto that bag so I am excited very happy with my decision um, update on mommy's bag she did get um, the I'm gonna call it just the baby zip zip <laughs> she got the bag like this that's the zip zip style but it's the smaller version so it's called the bitsy bag I did pick that one up for her um, and the caramel color and she loves it however she did say it's a little too small she does not carry a lot at all um, she don't carry nowhere near everything let alone the kitchen sink so I thought it would be perfect for her it kind of mimics some of the smaller bags she normally carries but she said because of that shape and that zipper it definitely closes it off where you can't really put things towards the top of your bag like she normally does and I completely understand that um, so I asked her to try this one out this one's too big she doesn't want to carry a bag this long especially since she doesn't really do the hand carry she likes to do a shoulder bag where it actually comes down to her hip or a little lower um, so we are gonna send the bitsy bag back we're kind of looking at some other bags to see what else she might like um, shoot I forgot the name of the one we were eyeballing uh... Yeah, I don't remember. I don't remember. Um, but we're kind of playing around and seeing what else that, you know, she might like. And we're thinking about having a little mini, like not an all day girls day thing. Um, but like a little mini girls day shopping this Saturday evening to see if we maybe can't find her something locally that she likes. If not, we'll just keep looking online until we do find something for her. So anyways, quick little unboxing just to show you guys my Greta Kiss Lock, um, which I am going to send back for now. She doesn't match anybody and I do like my SLGs matching and like to create, you know, little sets and stuff. So I'm going to send her back for now. And then if I do decide to pick up a bag in the future, I'll go ahead and pick her up. Then I could keep her and already have her. Um... But I don't want to do that. And this one, as y'all saw, the pockets are fucked up. So we're not keeping her in no way. So I'm not going to trouble them with exchanging another one right now. I can just wait until I get another bag. Zip Zip Satchel in the color white, a.k.a. she is not white. She looks like a cream, off-white, winter white, all that fun stuff. She's going back, wrong color, and too small. Hydrangea Drawstring, sexy bag. Love her, but the Tetris game, I don't want to have two bags like that. So I am going to send her back in exchange for a... Oops. For a Brenna in the same print so this Brenna should be here in this print in a couple of days so y'all know what that means <laughs> unboxing part six <laughs> and then miss blue here in all her glory is so damn sexy we absolutely love her we are keeping her she's good to go and then again like I said mommy's bitsy bag is going back and we're gonna find another one so if you guys have any ideas since I am you know new to buying new again Louis again or even if that Louis you hear me get it together Lola. new to buying Dooney again 
um, if you guys know of like a crossbody where essentially we've kind of done the math and figured out what is working, what isn't working. Mommy needs at least a four inch butt. Like she can't go any smaller than a four inch butt. Um, the width we hadn't really decided on. She carries a, po a pocket planner. Um, so if you guys have, you know, any ideas or seen any bags or just anything newly pop up, hell, tomorrow, that's a new bag that I know about. Definitely shoot me a DM on Instagram. Um, comment under one of the videos, whatever the case may be. Definitely let me know what you see, what you find. I love talking to you ladies these last couple videos i have had so many comments and so much love thank you so much i promise i'm getting around to responding to all of them but i literally had over 100 comments um and that is kind of new for me to have it like all at one time within like a two day span so i've been working through them as much as i can in between doing my other stuff but don't think that i forgot about you i don't love you i don't want to write back or any of that stuff i promise i'm working on it but also youtube sometimes doesn't show me all my comments so i'm definitely trying to find other avenues of getting to the comments to make sure that i respond to all of them so thanks for watching i'll see you guys in the next video i'm not positive what the next one is going to be um i'm hoping that i'm going to go ahead and do my what's in my bag next but like i said i want to get that little pouch first for my mom um that matches because i think it's going to look super cute so i do want to get that first and then i'll do the what's in my bag um and then yeah of course once my other um hydrangea arrives i will definitely do an unboxing so hey ladies see you later bye